Hello YouTube, welcome to Bricked. In this video we're trying to install a custom ROM after rooting our Samsung Tab 2, the 3110. And after failing, as you could see, the ROM could not be recognized or whatsoever kind of message. We killed Android. Here you can see that our Android just died. So, in this video, we will have to reanimate her and fix her. So, we're trying again another room, we're trying some other procedures. Boom, that again. See that? This is a dead Android, peeps. This thing is, yeah, it must be fixed. And uh, you can also see that uh, I'm trying another ROM again here, the Omni 4.4. And we try it again, so we reanimate it, we try to reprogram it, and it seems to go good. Loading, reading, the hope is there, the Omni might work. We are very hopeful. Oh, she died again. So, we will need to fix this. As you could see, we just bricked uh, this tablet. It's completely bricked. And I'm going to show you how to fix it. You will need to create an account at Sam Mobile. I have an account, so um, yeah, I could just go to Sam Mobile and download the file. It's a big file, though. It's 987 megabytes, so this will take a while to download because Sam Mobile is not the fastest uh, download site. But uh, at a certain point, we will have the file and then we can go fix it with uh, with others. Okay, in fact, I bricked this device. So I put this device in download mode, volume button down, and then turn the device on. And now it's in download mode. Now we're gonna hit Arden. It's Arden. you can see it's connected here you see it's blue and then we're gonna select the PDA I just downloaded the file I think it's uh, let me see on my desktop it should be here somewhere and if not let me check something real fast because it could be that Okay, this is the file. I think I must unpack it. Yes, and I need this file. Put it on my desktop. You see, this is the file for um, for the P3150. Okay, we extracted the file. I fire up Arden again. I see that it's loaded two times. Let me kill one. So it's connected there. So let's go for the PDA. It should be on my desktop. Desktop. Let's see where it is. There it is. You see it? The MD, MD5 uh, file. We're going to select that. And then we're going to pray and hit start. Let's see what's going to happen. Because this thing is completely bricked now. And this is the only way to fix it. As you can see, it's not responding. Don't worry about it. It's busy. I hope. It's a big file though. It's 1000 megabytes. If Arden is like not responding, 
don't worry, it's a big file and it must read the file. So it's like importing the file to its memory to then flash the device. Don't even worry if you see not responding. Just let it go. Not responding. It's a big file. Let's give it some time. After waiting patiently, you see that the factory reset is being performed. So when this is like completely full, then it will reboot the tablet. You see the tablet is being fixed now. This is the Samsung Tab 2. You saw the model here. It's the P3150, the GTP3150. And, uh, well, we're gonna let this process go. <clears throat> and it's going slowly, but this tablet will be fixed thanks to the update software. We're restoring to 4.2.2 back to 4.2.2 and then we will root it immediately after this process is done after the tablet is started up we will root it i also have a package for that how to do it uh, also have a little video of how to do that so uh, we check that as well but in this video you will also see the routing uh, of this tablet when it's done and not necessarily to install custom firmware because I had some failures, I must check it even better how to do it. Because, you know, um, yeah, in fact, I killed a good working tablet today. I bricked it, as you could see. The thing is completely bricked, but yeah, it will be fixed again after this uh, repair. And there's no other way to fix this. So, you know, um, yeah, if you have your tablet, it's not booting up anymore or you got some problem with installing yeah wrong firmware because in fact the firmware was not good otherwise we would not get that error or probably the the how you call it the bootloader is locked you know uh, many times it's uh, it's the case with uh, samsung tablets so we must find an even better way of how to install custom firmware on this baby i'll get back to you after the reboot okay we are up and running again and we're gonna now root this device to do that we will turn it off and then put it into a download mode just as we did uh, remember uh, to disconnect the cable before putting it into a download mode my battery is very very low it's complaining for me check my list and find the video how to root this device link will be in the description just like the link to Sam Mobile. Thanks for watching. Uh, like, subscribe if this helped you to fix your tablet. This will also work for the Tab 3 and the Tab 4, of course. Also for the Tab 1. Goodbye.